How's it going, YouTube? It's your boy, June. I feel like in all of these videos, I'm wearing this fucking black hoodie, and I think I am. It's the only one I got. Uh, so today, we're doing part two of getting Angelo's 350Z. I'll explain to you guys in a minute what happened uh, with the original one, with part one, with the one we want to go check out uh, together with Ricky. Uh, today, it's just me and Angelo, and I'm going to make part two out of it. Yeah, so I hope you guys like it. You guys are as hype as we are. So I tried backing up. Uh, I'm fucking stuck in my yard. My brother's gonna come out here and try to help me push it. It's a good start to the day though. This is how I wanted every day to start right here. I'm officially on the road. We're on our way to uh, Angelo's house. Like I said, I, well, I didn't want to record my back roads because those are still pretty bad. I'm on the highway now and it's, it's pretty dry. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna go to Angelo's house. We're gonna vlog. It's an hour trip today to Lexington, North Carolina. We're gonna check out this other 350Z that is sold a little bit more pricier. It's like a private dealer type thing. Like it's like it's a it's a dealer owned by one guy or whatever. I really don't know what we're doing. To tell the truth, we're just about to go to Angelo's house, basically just take a road trip to go see a 350Z. Uh, let me explain to you guys what had happened. From my understanding, what happened with the other 350Z in part one that we are no longer gonna pursue anymore. It was a blue 350Z, it was on the thumbnail, uh, was sold by a guy in Durham. He listed the 350Z for 5800 on Craigslist. We were able to talk him down 5K, talked him down $800, and something just wasn't adding up, go down $100 or $800. So uh, we get the VIN number or whatever. We're here with Angelo. What up? We're gonna go find another 350Z. Tell him what happened yesterday with that. All right, so yesterday we went and looked at the car, obviously. It went good, it looked good, it looked clean and everything. And then when I got home, I asked the guy for the VIN number. I ran a Carfax report on it. It had fucking uh, 205,000 miles in 2011. And it said on the dash there was uh, 121,000. So he switched that shit, trying to make a quick buck, fuck somebody over, so walked away from that. But today, we're going to look at a uh, all black 350Z 2003. It's from the dealer. Uh, yeah, it's from a, it's from a private dealer. Yeah, we're going to go try and look at that today, test drive it, maybe negotiate a price and probably pick up a Z today if we're lucky. <laughs> if, we're, yeah, if everything turns out good, they don't fucking try to bullshit us. Right now, we got a little bit of time to kill, so we're going to go hit up like some small dealers around and see if we can find a Z around here. If not, still got what, an hour and a half to kill. Yeah. Keep it posted what, what goes down in the B town, basically, <laughs> in Burlington. Yeah, that's, uh, that's right. Yeah. yeah. Hopefully it's the hype as fuck. Look at the muffler, man. Little muffler, man. If you guys seen my first uh, vlog, this is where we were at, chilling with the pros. This was it. This is the muffler, man. We're about to fix an exhaust leak in the cobalt, in the slow bolt, so he can sell it off. So we're not screwing anybody over whenever he sells the car. So that's where we're at right now. <laughs> On the way to actually go see the 350Z, we're officially on the way and stop by McDonald's or something to get food. But after that, we're gonna be on the way, yeah. And uh, we should be there in about an hour, it's 2:45 right now. We should be getting there around 3:30, 3:45. We're about to hit like 80 on the freeway. Nope, no, we're not. Uh, we're gonna go 67 miles per hour on the freeway, you know, so we don't get that ticket. Two miles over, two miles over. Uh, I honestly think we should go 65 if there's any cops watching or anything like that. We're not speeding at all, it's 35 here. Oh, we're going 35. Yeah, we're going about that. Yeah, I'm pretty sure they can hear <laughs> Yeah, but um, so time lapse of the trip starts now.
about 10 minutes away, just around there. I'm seeing the Z for the very first time, and uh, the roads look badass out here. There's no ice, so we're, we're definitely, he's definitely gonna be able to test drive it, and hopefully we can buy it, or he can buy it and take it home. Hell oh, yeah. I mean, look. We better buy a car in the junkyard, guys. Oh, there we go. Where it at? Ooh. Looking nice from here. Oh shit. Oh yeah, that's shit. That looks clean, man. Look, that looks, it looked like he cleaned it. He had to have cleaned it. Woo! Go in there and be like, we made it! It looks pretty clean. It looks really nice. Clean, clean interior, clean exterior. So we're about to test drive the Z. Trying to get out of here. It's a little bit still. Just trying to get used to the clutch real quick. He wants 67, he wants 69, but he said the lowest would go 67. Let me show you guys the interior, so this is basically, it's all clean as hell. Look at that, that works. We just, I don't know, you have it turned off, I think he has it turned off. Yeah, we'll just, yeah. you gotta get updated with the yeah. CD though. Something like that, I don't know. Six speed, both speakers. It's pretty fucking clean, like there's really not that, that broke or anything, like all of this works. Hard to find like that's a little that's, it's a little flimsy but it works. Hard to find like cars with like shit like this that works. Alright, so what are your first impressions of 350? I like the 350Z. This one is nice. You got leather seats, heated. Why the fuck is the parking brake up? Because you're stupid! You put it up! I've never even touched any I have not touched anything over there. Shit. You fucking liar. That's you probably, probably put it up. That's probably why I slid out. That's probably why we fucking slid out. So we're in the Z right now. Like, so tell us what happened, AJ. Test drove it. Everything felt good, sounded good. It drove good, stuck to the road. We got back here. He wanted a little bit too much. He wanted 6,700 as his bottom dollar. And the most I'd do on it is probably 6,300. Told him I might check back next week and see if he wants to lower the price at all. Like go from there, I'm definitely gonna keep it in mind. Yeah, but I'm gonna keep looking at the same time. You might find something better, you never know. But that's the update. And now we're on the way home. So basically what ended up happening was we went home or whatever. I had to go to work, so I really couldn't close anything. Like I was in a hurry back home. Um, today's Thursday, it's been a day or two. As I record this video, Angelo and Ricky are there buying that 350Z. I believe he talked them down like he actually came with cash in his hand and was able to talk them down a little bit more. I don't know the full details on it. Be on the lookout, because we're gonna make videos with it. But yeah, that's pretty much it. So he was able to get it. As far as I know, they've been texting me. Thank you guys for watching. Subscribe if you haven't already. Follow me on Instagram, J-U-N-G-T-8-6 underscore. And keep a lookout for future videos. I'm your boy, June. Until next time. We try to make it out of this hill real quick. Damn. Try one. You got this dog.